Welcome to Managing and Leading Change, a course full of real-world strategies and tools. I'm Mike Clayton, and my experience started as a project manager and leader of change for international consultants Deloitte, where I led complex change programs in some of our largest clients. Since then, I've been heavily involved in training professionals, managers and leaders in both project and change related activities. I'm the author of 14 books and I've produced a number of training videos for platforms such as this. By the end of this course, you'll be able to do a lot of things. You'll be able to convince people about the need for change and evaluate how people feel about those changes. You'll be able to paint a compelling picture of the changes to come and anticipate how people will respond as you move through the change process. You'll also be able to anticipate how the changes will affect operational performance and you'll be able to plan effective communications. And perhaps most valuable of all, you'll be able to handle resistance to change because I know this is one aspect of change that managers fear most. Let's take a look at the subjects we'll be covering in this course. I'm sure you're wondering, how can I practice what I'm learning on this program? So I provided a mini case study for you to follow. There are a number of exercises and at points during the program, I'll be asking you to read the scenario and put yourself in the place of the change managers leading the change program. There'll be questions to answer about the situation and you'll be able to share your answers on the platform for other students and for me to comment on. Managing and leading change have been a passion for me for many years. Ever since I first encountered the difference between project management at one end of a spectrum and change management at the other. I've learned that it's no good just being a project manager or just being a change manager. So this course is designed to help you with the change management end of the spectrum. It's a topic I absolutely love. There's a huge amount to say about it. So let's dive straight in. <laughs> 